Hi there, it's Jonathan with CarGenerator.com. So we're gonna show you how you connect the car generator to power your cottage or your house during a power outage. So this house is, or this cottage is without power right now and I'm gonna show you how you hook up the car generator right here. So, right here, that's the car generator. And then inside, we connect it to the booster, booster point cables or wherever your battery is like that and then inside you run an extension cord and plug it in directly inside the car generator there's two outlets in there you just pick one of them and then we have an extension cord which we are running beautiful it's all dark in here Hopefully we can see where we're going here. That's great. So we have an extension cord, it's about 50 feet, and we're running it through the front door and in and down into the furnace room. Pretty easy, pretty simple. All right. And inside here, ta-da, we have power. So this is power being provided by the actual car generator unit. So here's our furnace, whoops, sorry. Here's our furnace. And you'll notice that we have a plug installed. So this is a furnace only plug. So when the power goes out, all you do simply is take this plug, disconnect it, and plug it into your car generator. And just like that, your furnace is now powered. And that's it. That's how you run your power to your furnace and it'll take a minute or two until the thermostat kicks in and we have heat. With this, you can stay warm for a couple hours, up to a couple of days, using just the power of your car. Up to a thousand watts, pure sine wave, and check it out, www.cargenerator.com. Thanks for watching.